Well, here we are on number eight hole at Eagle Ridge. It's a, from here we've got 165 yards to the flag. It's downhill. It's a very picturesque hole. It's surrounded by bunkers. Pins just a little right of centre. Pretty well straight down breeze. My shot is I played the ball just a little bit left of the pin, uh, but playing a bit, a bit safe for uh, the commercial side. Nice and relaxed. Yeah, that's um, what do you say, 20, 20 feet? It's a little bit short, isn't it? Yep. Stopped fairly quickly. But I was quite happy with the shot. Yep. So now it's your turn. Get inside that, buddy. Hey, no problem. I could hit mine a little harder, probably. I'll bring the camera a bit behind your line now. What a great looking shot. What iron did you play there, Jake? Super seven. shot. A seven. Yeah, it's dropped into the bunker behind the green. It, it carried over the green? Yeah. yeah just Maybe bounced just, just on the back edge. You're a gorilla. No doubt about you. But nice, nice contact. Great contact. Yeah, yeah. yeah. fantastic. Super. Well, Jake, here we are. You, you, you were right, right. Pretty well over the flag. You're a bit unfortunate. Your caddy gave you the wrong club. <laughs> I couldn't believe you an eight iron was the right club for you. But anyway, uh, you're going into the bunker you, and yes, see I how am. it's got a special area to walk in. Yep. So it's good manners. If it put the there, there you go and use it, okay? It's out and on. Probably going to, have to do a little work on your bunker play, but, but that was, you know, you, you, you exploded that one out, so it was a safe shot. We haven't, we haven't touched on the bunker play, Pete. So I've, I've, I'm very, good. I'm not confused, but I'm, I'm not trying to play a bunker shot because I don't know how. So. Well, we have to go into, you have to go into our master coaching community and have a look at the bunker, <laughs> the bunker lessons. <laughs> okay, you probably didn't expect to get in any. <laughs> it's funny you said it. Um, yeah, between this and murder, I don't, 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 don't get in a lot of bunkers. And they've got plenty there. But this is a great hole, great par three, uh, hitting down to this green. Well, my ball did it, it stopped on the front of the green, so. So let's see, uh, see if I can apply myself here. I can see from, it feels, the putt feels from right to left. I can, pretty sure I it'll come from right to left.
contract is a little, a little bit more juice. So I'll finish that while I'm while I'm going. Sounds good to me. Well, I never. Okie dokie. Do you normally take the glove off when you cut? No, I don't. I, I usually just leave it on. So you got this to, to win the hole. Now you got that one for yeah. the half. Good putt. Well done. That was better concentration. It was. Okay, so number nine at Eagle Ridge. It's a par five. There's a lake on the right-hand side of the green. It's a nice opportunity for a birdie if you've got the length, but it's 487 yards, 443 metres from the back tees, and uh, a nice finishing hole for the front nine. Well, Jake, here we are, number 9T. And, uh, yep, pretty well straight away. You can't see the fairway from here, but it's uh, there's, there's plenty of it yeah. over, over the top of that ridge. Yeah. Breeze coming sort of across us here. Yeah. So just aim down the, the left centre is a good safe spot. Well, you got the little fade going, but it's going to be in the fairway, I think. Yeah, somewhere close to the fairway. Yeah, nice. Good contact, good distance. We're going to work on that, straightening up that fade, okay? Uh, because the trees are on the right, I, I tee the ball a little bit left to centre on the thing, on the gives me a bit more room. And uh, I'll be aiming down the left hand side of the fairway here. Good as I can do, in the perfect spot, left centre. Away we go. Okay, well, this is one of those shots where I'm just on the edge. I'm carrying the, the greenside bunker in front of the pin. I, I was about 192 metres, which is about 200 and, 217 yards. And, what's that? At, at 10%, 20, 212. Good. 
Yeah, it's flush. Just caught the hit the bunker. Well, Jack's surveying his shot, and he's. I think he's doing making a smart smart decision. He's going to play safe. It, uh, carrying the bunker is a bit of a uh, bit of a, a, a gamble, like I tried to. Yeah. And seven, uh, iron. seven iron, good on you, buddy. And you got to just going to put it there in front of the green and pitch it on in one putt, eh? Okay, Jake. Look, I can see uh, the top of a, a roof down there. I can see some some a tree on the left. What, what's your target there? Yeah, it is pretty much probably the edge of that roof line. Oh, there's a telephone pole a bit further on. Um, so kind of like the edge of this bunk back here. So that's probably okay. my target line. Okay, very good. You, you got to visualise the shot before you hit it, and that that really helps cement the shot into your subconscious. What a super hit. I mean, you're hitting those irons really flush now. Okay, Jake, uh, you got a little pitch here laid up, just perfect, just short of the bunker. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I've got, a, it's about 45 yards or so. Um, not a great deal of green in front of the, 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 the pin, so I need something that's gonna stop pretty quickly. I've taken out my present from you, Pete, the 50, the, the 64, which has okay. even bent even further, I believe. Yeah, no, it's got 67 degrees aloft now. So that, that'll stop pretty well. I think this is pretty much, a, be pretty pretty well a full swing. Yeah, so pretty close, yeah, up. even for your power. What a beautiful shot, hey! You've... Oh, no, it's going to run out. We're going to run right up there. Maybe, maybe a few feet short, but a, yeah. a great shot. I mean, playing the, the short time you played, I'm really impressed. That's yeah, a lot of good, a lot of tour pros like you that close. <laughs> yeah. Camera's and rolling. Camera's rolling, and here we go. We've got we've got a group behind us who are coming up pretty quickly, so we're um we're moving a bit quicker than we normally would when we're filming, Pete. Yes, well I got a long bunker shot, so yep. I got my 52 degree out, and uh, I got about 40 plus yards. Ball's a bit on the upslope, so that'll, that'll make it go a little shorter. Just going to play a bunker shot with a 52 degree gap wedge. We are at the ninth green, and yes. you're going to putt out first to show me the line. That's very kind of you. Yeah, absolutely. Now I don't have any ball markers, so I'm um, oh, sorry. Um, yeah. Yeah, if you got to, you got to mark your ball, you need a ball marker. So we're going to make sure you got some money in your pocket next time. <laughs> yeah, plastic's no good. Not on the green. up there oh just a little harder would have that was a good putt Jake well you made a nice par on the ninth hole now you've shown me the line so I, I should be able to hold mine <laughs> what have you got there Pete 15 15 feet 10 15 yeah I'm probably more, more like about 18 18 footer so let me go back and focus so I like to really visualize the line I got a spot Aim over. 
you got me. I thought it would break in like that after yours. <laughs> but uh, it was a good putt. So a par, you can't, you always take pars. Fantastic. Now I'm just going to quickly grab the flag. As I do, Pete, tell me, you had probably like an inch there, but you've, you've taken, you've gone through your routine to actually put yeah, it. I recommend everybody. put into a field deal so you don't have to think so much and and the, and the less you have to think and the more you can play by feel so you practice the short ones and that's where you really you get better skill great